now. He's exhausted. He's a power of a man. And the, the lactic acid will be burning through his muscles. And there are elephants and pianos falling across his shoulders. But you're right, he hung on. So let's move on. Now the women's 100 metres freestyle S12. Eight finalists here. Hannah Russell lines up. Only in one note. Delgado Nadal from Spain. Mendak goes in two for Poland. Snicker of Germany goes in lane number three. 10503 to qualify. There's Hannah Russell, 10148. Svakalova in five for the Russian Federation. Deborah Font goes in six for Spain. Stavrovska goes in seven for the Ukraine. And to complete the lineup in lane number eight from Argentina, Annabel Moro, 108.64 for her this morning to qualify. So, really, Hannah Russell on her own. Some three and a half seconds clear of a world-class field. All eyes on her in lane four. And Russell, this is qualifier but I expect her to be pressed by Daria Stukalova. Russian swimmer in the white cap there, up there in lane five. Russell and Stukalova both came onto the international scene at the European Championships two years ago. Both progressed to win Paralympic medals last year in London. And Stukalova, as I thought, is going very much faster than she did in the heats this morning. She's half a second of Hannah Russell with Naomi Schnitger in third position. But Stukalova looking very, very good, very strong. Hannah Russell has got to work it out to come back. She's in second position and Schnitger in third, but Stukalova coming into the last 15, into the lead for the Russian Federation. Stukalova, absolutely wonderful performance, five metres away from the wall and her strokes just so fluid, bang into the finish, 59-71, well 58-41 was the world record. She really has pulled something out of the bag, finding some five seconds improvement there. Must have been very, very comfortable this morning to qualify. Swimming inside a minute, the magic minute barrier. Daya Stukalova of the Russian Federation, the world champion. Some great dive starts there. A couple flying high perhaps, but the rest really darting into the water very quickly, trying to get off the blocks in around about 0 0.6, 0 0.7 of a second and trying to clear lots of fresh air to break into the water a long way down the pool. Having a tight tuck, a tight tumble turn there. Stuck all over, kind of a little bit short, perhaps around about uh, four metres, only just. And Russell just couldn't match, perhaps the strength of Stuckalova. Shorter in her stroke. A smaller competitor, doesn't quite have the same leverage. Head down here, or did she take a breath there? The head was so low, which is a good thing. I'm not sure whether she took a quick breath to the right-hand side, but didn't interfere with her body line, didn't reduce the speed into the finish for a tremendous gold medal. Sometimes you see the faces of the visually impaired swimmers not looking too happy. We saw Varaxa stuck all over there, but the scoreboard is 50 metres away from these guys and uh, the ones with the visual impairment they definitely won't be able to see the scoreboard from that distance there is a confirmed result of the women's 100 freestyle s12 daria stukalova from russia takes the gold 59-71 russell the silver for great britain schnittgar the bronze for germany